All right, look who's back. Matt and Timothy. <laughs> back on the East Coast now. We're in Greenville, South Carolina. And uh, we are at Paris Mountain State Park. I came here about uh, six months ago. Actually, what am I thinking? Like about 12 months ago and had a really cool experience of a cold water lake. Um, I think it's spring fed and it stays the same temperature year round, which is really cool. Um, and you recognize that, that guy, don't you? <laughs> anyway. Yeah, we kind of started out thinking we were just going to do a pickup, uh, drop off uh, Timothy's girlfriend. And guess what? We're going to have an adventure. Why not? Right. An unplanned adventure. We didn't really bring what we needed. We had to stop and kind of pick up what we needed. But uh, yeah, it's going to be going to be an exciting day, I feel like. I think last time we were in uh, California praying that the Holy Spirit just lead us and guide us and connect us with whomever he is best. And we did the same thing today. Um, so we'll see what this day, what God has in store for us. Good stuff. <laughs> so Matt does this thing. He's like uh, an expert at it. Like where you leave the car and he's like, oh, I forgot something. I go back. And he just did it twice. So I had to, I had to vlog it at this point. <laughs> All right, guys. We're here at this lake. And it's nice and cold. And it's hot outside. You can see some falls right there. It's like a, where the dam is. But um, I'm going to share a little secret with you guys. Matt went off on a run. I'm not sure where he's at. He's been gone for a while, but this right here. Picking up a frozen bag of berries. Man, they stay good for hours, and uh, it is such a nice, refreshing, healthy treat on a hike. And even if it melts, it's not gonna, you know, it's in a bag, so it's not gonna leak, it's not gonna like leak out into your bag. Or... I'm uh, gonna walk up this trail. Apparently there's a waterfall up here, a little waterfall. Um, Matt just got back from his run and he said it was about five to ten minutes up this way, but I wanted to see this little creek right there. And the south, for those of you who've never been to the south, I'd highly recommend checking it out, especially the Carolinas and Georgia. There is a peaceful nature here that, I mean, you know, the west coast, there's something really special and majestic about the west coast, but something very calming and soothing about the south. Um, but I want to tell you guys about the Ambassador Program. Uh, it's an our, our online community. It's for people who are thinking about coming on a retreat, or some like if you can't make it on a retreat for whatever travel reasons. Um, we do the same things that we do on retreats, but we just do them over Skype, FaceTime. We meet with you on a weekly basis, and we really get to know you, develop a, re a real relationship, and we give you exercises and assignments that uh, have benefited our life the most. And we wanna share that with you. And just helping you become more a whole person, just the, the person that you wanna be. And you know whether it's you wanna have a, a girlfriend, you wanna get in better shape, or whether you wanna develop your own business program, start making money doing what you love, then the Ambassador Program's really great for that. Check this out. Yeah, a little creek, that's cool. Um, yeah, but if you're interested in doing that, just email us, robbrows at gmail.com, subject line ambassador, and we'll, uh, we'll get back to you. Well, guys, I think I passed the waterfall. Um, when Matt said little waterfall, he might have meant real little. <laughs> um, I saw this little thing, some water trickling down a rock, and I was like, is that the waterfall he's talking about? And after walking for about 15 minutes now, I'm convinced that is so stay tuned and I'll show you the waterfall All right, so I think this is the waterfall that Matt's talking about It's pretty cool and It's really beautiful uh, But as you can see maybe you could maybe you could see why I was confused maybe not He doesn't know I'm up here Good buddy! The most important thing 
when your pole is plunging, you gotta get your head under the water. Yeah, once you get that head under, you're gonna feel happier, healthier, and wealthier than you ever have before. <laughs> That's refreshing. Have you jumped in this side yet? Uh-uh. We're here in downtown Greenville. If you guys have never been to downtown Greenville, you should check it out. It's beautiful. They have this uh down this like grassy area, rivers and stages that you can perform on. Alright, so uh we just stopped in this Froyo place. <laughs> and I got some froyo, but we're about to go eat at a Persian restaurant. Matt's uh, craving some Indian food. He eats. What's that? <laughs> it's Persian food, not Indian food. Well, the origin of Persia is. You don't know. Well, I actually do. It's Iran, which it's is not Indian. Y yeah, they are. Iran? Iran is not India, that's Middle East. <laughs> <All right. laughs> I'm pretty sure oh, uh, Timothy will not be the Rob Ross representative to the United Nations, is what we're saying. <laughs> so now I'm feeling insecure about my ignorance about geography. But that's funny. I feel like I'm not alone when when like all of a sudden when maybe you have a, a brain fart about geography. Don't you, do you ever feel really shameful about that or like it's like really embarrassing to get geography mixed up? Um, I wonder why that is. Yeah. And it's funny to me because, I mean, you probably haven't studied geography in what, eight years? No. But they expect you to just, like people expect you to just remember that stuff like for your whole life, you know? When you maybe studied it for a semester of school when you were in high school. Yeah. And you're supposed to remember it for the rest of your life, but... Yeah. There's like there's like a real like uh, embarrassment that happens like when like you mess up with like your geography. Yeah. All right, I just want to show y'all what downtown Greenville looks like a little bit. Look at those dogs in the back, man. Those things are crazy. But yeah, it's a cool city. Uh, if you've never been, I would highly recommend at least coming down, checking it out for a little bit. Um, yeah. Eat, at, eat at Pomegranate Restaurant for some pretty good Persian food. I've never had Persian food, but it's pretty good. Persia from India. <laughs> I just wanted y'all to see it. Y'all, you can see that there's a river running right through the city. The river runs through it. It's a great movie. You ever see that movie? Have you seen that movie? Yes. Hel Come on, bro. Who is it? Helen Hunt? Huh? No, what's the girl's name that plays in there? Uh, the main actress. Main actress that plays through river runs through it. Come on. Check it out. Anyway. Wow, this bridge is moving a little bit. Yeah, it's a pretty awesome bridge. It's like suspended. Yeah, it is. I gotta say thanks to God uh, taking us to such beautiful areas, creating such a beautiful world. Can't wait for Oregon, May 28th. Yeah, be there, Oregon. Yeah, it's gonna be epic. Yes, sir.